It was our first time to build, so it was completely new to us. And we really, like I said, we went from an idea to, or a thought to build to actually doing it really quickly. And probably ideally we should have taken longer to do our homework. On the very early stages, we had a couple of hiccups about site works, costs and things like that, which actually turned out their estimation of cost was bang on. Uh, so it was actually nothing that we had to worry about, but just being new to it, we just, um, you know, we, we weren't sure what to expect. But uh, no, they, overall they were, they, were, they were quite, they were very good. So it's not a simple process building a house, which we learnt. So, you know, there's, there's always going to be challenges, but um, uh, we were really happy with And Trent so, was really good. Yeah, yeah. great supervisor. Like Trent did a, did a great job during the build. So. We had actually a family friend who worked for a high end builder. He, he was a building supervisor. So his last home was a build of $60 million. Um, and he was really impressed with Trent and the drawings that were delivered like for the, for the house. Um, and, and so, you know, like we were really happy with how the, the build turned out. Because we had a, such a small kitchen before, it's more open and I can see the kids here. So I think the kitchen and living areas are... I really like the, the open plan feel. Uh, it does make us feel like as a family, like as Nanako said, the girls could be playing, where well, we could be doing this, but you still can see each other, you're still together. Um, and I, I love the, like, the master bedroom turned out. Mm -hmm. um, and the other house before, we, we didn't have any alfresco or anything, so that's, that's nice to have as well.